Hello, this is Seth, and I'm here to review the three cases that Apple makes for the iPhone 12 and 12 Pro. So here we have the clear case. Here we have the leather case. Here we have the silicone case. Let's take these out. And also, I have the iPhone leather wallet case. So let me start with my least favorite out of these and then I will tell you why. So my least favorite of the three is the silicone case. It's a well built case, I get I have to give it that, but I hold my phone like this and look at my finger. I cannot get a good grip on this case my hands just slide all over it and that's the point i'm trying to get with the case is be able to use this phone with one hand so i would say no to the silicone case i know it's brand new and maybe this will actually um get better but i'm not sure so i'm probably gonna return this case In this case is nearly perfect. People say this is slippery, but like I'm using a lot of force here. And it holds pretty nicely. Let me see the thickness here. All right, it's around the same thickness, but it just feels thinner because the phone is tighter to this case. But the reason why I'm not going with this case is because of these buttons are horrendous. You have to click with like double the force to just do volume or shut your phone off, which is a little ridiculous. So I wouldn't go with this case either. The case I'm going to go with is the leather case. One, because it's just nice looking. Two, these buttons are so easily clicked. And it's not that slippery, like, it's between this, it's like almost the same slipperiness as the clear case, but the buttons are good. So this is what I'm going with. And supposedly leather gets, wears nicely and it might actually be more grippy, so. it's what I'm going with. So let me put them on the phone and I'll show you what they look like. So let me start with the silicone. So, silicone, see it's not bad, like I can't say that if it's a bar of soap and your hand's gonna just, the phone's just gonna fall to your hand, but like, I just don't, I don't feel secure with this on, like I feel like it's just gonna fall out of my, it's like, I don't know, I just don't really like it, so, so is this case, okay, so let me put the wallet on it so I can just show you, it's nice, I mean, Honestly, the wallet sticks the best on the silicone for some reason. Like, downwards, I have to press the hardest. Eh, there's actually like a spot you gotta, like a sweet spot to get it off. But without trying, this is actually pretty stable on the silicone. Take this off here. So out of tightness on the case, this fits probably a little better than the leather. And then the clear case is the tightest to the phone by far. I'm not going to put the clear one on because it's like nearly impossible to take off. And if I'm returning it, I can't crack it. In this case, is loose, the most loose on the phone. Like it just slides right on and I'm, like I can pop it right off if I want. So, but like, I don't know, just feels the nicest in my hand. And I think it looks the nicest, like... Look at that. It's pretty. And then with the wallet. I've been using it for three days and I do not think it's going to come off. So, I mean, I think it's pretty nice. Get that out of there. So, honestly, I'd go with these two. It's the most expensive and honestly, if I didn't have the Apple card and I wasn't paying 
installments, I would not do this because $120 is ridiculous for a case combo. But since it's like $7 a month with installments, it makes me feel a little less guilty. So this is what I'm doing. So, yeah, I'm only making this video because there's a lot of videos out there that are professional and really nice. But they go over the basic differences, like one's clear, one's leather. I've just been searching for a case for so long with this phone because of the squared off design to feel nice in the hand that I thought I'd make this just to, if someone's having the same issue as me, try the leather case or if you don't mind using double the force to click buttons, get the silicone. I mean the clear case, not the silicone case. But honestly, if you have the app card, do what I did. With the COVID, you can't go in and try the cases, so just order them all and keep the one you like or return them all and just go caseless like I was about to do. So thanks for watching and I'd actually do a lot of review videos if this caught on, but right now I have no subscribers and it's not worth it, but I have an Apple card. So, I mean, I can review all of the Apple products. Like if you can't see, I have a lot of Apple product boxes down there. So I'm a big Apple fan. Love to do this as a side job, but you know, who knows? Like, subscribe. Peace out.